All right, welcome to New York Eternix. I'm gonna show you really quick how I can tell my males from my females here in the grow out hutch. He's, uh, they're exactly six weeks old, so it's pretty easy to tell at this point, aside from telling them, you know, from the patterns on their chests. Let's take a look. There we go. And I caught one, <laughs> just like this. All right, so let's see. All right, so here we have number three. And you can tell, it already looks like a female because of the uh, pattern on the chest. But if you take a look, Right up under here, this is where we vent them. There's a gland that if you squeeze, it'll foam. Now that's not foam, that's poop. This is definitely a girl. I'm gonna put her back. Grab a roof, grab a roof. You're not a roof. Number 13. But we'll do this again anyway. So this isn't a roux either, I don't think. But again, if you look, oh, look, and no, that's poop. So yeah, know the difference between poop and a foam. Definitely not a roof. I'll get you one. All right, here's one of our boys. So you can take a look at the chest. He has the uh, golden tan pattern right there. Well, it's not really a pattern, it's just a color. And then we're gonna take a look under here. And if you press on that gland, you'll see the foam. You see the foam right there? That's definitely a boy. That's a root. That's how you tell the difference. The females, they won't foam like that. They might have a little poop or whatever, but yeah. 